Yo, if you guys want your clips to look like this, all stretched and sweaty looking, but you got an A and D GPU, I got you. Just keep watching. Yo, so in this video, I'm going to show you guys how to get true stretch res on Valorant for AMD. This will work on pretty much most games, but most people want on Valorant. First thing you have to do is download WinXP. It's going to be linked in the description. Just search WinXP. Come here. This one right here. Nearsoft.net. Scroll down. Download WinXP. Download it. Extract it. We'll use this later. Next step is making your custom resolution. So for AMD, you launch your AMD software. For NVIDIA, this is pretty much the same thing. You can use this video for a NVIDIA card. You just got to make your custom res, which is pretty simple. Um, for some reason, there's not a lot of videos on AMD, and if there are videos, they're not very good. So this is going to be in-depth. Hopefully, you have no questions. If you do, comment. I'll help you. Um, custom res, create new. Okay? I already have mine here. So since I'm on a 2560 by 1440, I'm going to be playing on 1920 by 1440. Okay? Um, I'll pop up some resolutions you can use on the video right now. I don't remember the 1080p stretched res off the top of my head. But, so I'm stretched width-wise, right? 2560, I went to 1920, and I kept this the same. Um, your refresh rate, all this, uh, your timing and stuff should be right. Like, if this isn't right, you gotta, like, Google the calculator for it. It's kind of annoying. Sometimes if you change your refresh hertz to, like, 143 instead of 144, it will fix this. I don't know why. Okay, save this. And now, you need to go to your scaling mode and have it on full panel. This is what makes it stretch. Um... So, first thing you want to do is make sure your desktop res is on its native resolution. For me, it's 2560 by 1440. For you, it's probably 1920 by 1080. Then you need to launch Valorant. Go to Valorant, Settings. Okay. You want it to be full screen, your native resolution, aspect ratio on fill, and then apply it. Once it's applied, go to Windowed and apply it. Okay. Now go to your window setting, change it to your custom res, which is 1920 by 1440. Your screen will go back for a second, accept it. Every time you change your resolution, it's gonna reset your uh, hertz. So change your hertz to the fastest one. It's gonna be 144, 170, something like that. Um, apply, keep changes. Now you need to launch WinXP, run it as administrator. Click on Valorant, go to Style, uncheck these bottom two, DLG Frame and Border. Uncheck, uncheck, Size and Position, Maximized. And now, our Val is stretched. So you can, I don't know, I don't know how well you can tell in the video, but like, you'll see the store is a little bit buggy because it's kind of weird looking, but in-game it looks fine. Um, when you're loading in, there might be black bars up here and here. That's just so the image fits in your screen. But I'll show you once I'm in the range here, you'll see the character models are actually stretched. This is true stretch, which is different than just having uh, the wrong resolution in game. Like this actually stretches the models. It's technically only bannable in like tournaments and stuff like that. So you can't like go to like a land tournament and play on true stretch because it gives you an advantage. But Val itself will not ban you because it's literally just a resolution. Like there's nothing, there's no cheating or anything here. Like this is not bannable at all. But as you can see, uh, let me turn on the strays. As you can see, everything's just a little bit wider, but your FOV is like narrow, right? So there's pros and cons to everything, but I like this because let's say I go all the way back here. Like that head is very clickable from this distance compared to like normal resolution where it's way smaller. Um, so once you're done, let's say you log off for the night, you close valve. Your resolution is going to stay at whatever you had. So if you just play nothing but Val, you can keep it here, but you have to, when you relaunch Val, you have to be on your native resolution. Relaunch Val. Do the same steps where you got to have it full screen um, with the fill layout. You got to apply it. Then you got to go to window. Then you got to go back to windows. Then you got to change your resolution. Then you got to go to WinXP. Then you got to turn off these two. And then you got to do maximized every single time. It takes like two or three minutes. But I think it's worth it. Makes the clips look cool. Makes me play better. I like it. Uh, that's really it.